I'm Holly Lemassurier. I work for the City of Eugene, Oregon in the City Manager's Office. I am the Human Rights Analyst, a staff member of the City's Equity and Human Rights Center, and staff the City of Eugene Human Rights Commission. The City of Eugene has benefited for over 40 years from a robust Human Rights Commission and its spin-off projects, immersing our community in international human rights standards for several decades. Um, the community also has a very strong community coalition for the advancement of human rights. Um, recently, Eugene City Government has also developed a five-year diversity and equity strategic plan with a human rights framework as one of its main infrastructural elements. Um, some outcomes of the plan of the Diversity and Equity Strategic Plan will be increased training on and reporting of human rights standards, as well as considering social equity issues in all programming and policies. The city created a city staff equity and human rights board, which will work closely on projects and policies with the Human Rights Commission and the Community Coalition. Um, some of the first couple of collaborative projects that have emerged um, were the creation of a bias and hate incident response plan, um, an annual public forum on the state of equity and human rights in Eugene, and recently um, the community put on a very successful human rights summit, um, a collaborative project between the city, the Human Rights Commission, the Equity and Human Rights Board, and the Community Coalition. And over 200 people attended, over 50 partners were represented, um, and a lot of amazing um, outcomes came out of that summit. It is critical that we support monitoring and reporting of U.S. compliance with international human rights standards, as well as contribute to any coalition reporting um, that we can. The reports reflect our collaboration and coordinate our efforts and raise significant awareness of our priority targets, our target interventions. We need to assess and understand where we are and help others understand um, and also come to a unified understanding of where we're going. Um, telling others the story of our work will continually shed more and more light on the complex and dynamic problems of human rights and social justice um, in the United States. And perhaps telling these stories will attract new resources. We need to know the dimensions of the challenges that we're addressing and measure how our work is making a positive difference. Um, if your agency can dedicate the staff resource or you can identify an intern or a volunteer to work on reporting, it's really important. The IAOHRA members can gain a lot from reporting on the work they are doing in their communities in this forum. And I look forward to learning more about the members' activities and resources. When members highlight their policy um, and program solutions, their initiatives and innovations, um, and also the small-scale grassroots micro-project successes um, that achieve results, others can then utilize these models. And it would be great if as we improve our reporting and sharing, if more fiscal resources to address our needs could also be attracted. Um, I look forward to being a member of the forum and focused on solutions, support, and resources. We have everything to gain by sharing our resources and experience with the federal government. Developing a clearer, more concise picture of our country's conditions and its people's challenges is work that will never be fully accomplished, it seems. Um, our data and perspectives are essential to telling the story of America. Um, the U.S. government benefits from our agency's monitoring of social conditions um, as well as monitoring relationships and understanding um, um, social dynamics and as well as our advocacy and implementation of equitable and safe standards at the local and state levels. Um, we know that very successful and sustainable projects have grown out of one person's experience or a small local group's reaction to a very specific problem 
And many of these have been based entirely on coordinating volunteer resources and have required very little financial capital. Um, we have developed very doable solutions, but the successes are quite isolated in our communities or among constituent groups. And by sharing our data and solutions with the federal government, perhaps they could assist us in more widely publishing our resources or our toolkits and provide these resources to places that may not otherwise have access to the assets. The work the City of Eugene is doing to implement the Human Rights Framework focuses on respecting, protecting, and fulfilling human rights as our vision. Um, and in our actions, we are promoting and advocating for human rights and equity.